Hello everyone, today we'll be making these beautiful lamb chops in an indoor grill. I'm using the George Foreman indoor grill. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and share with your friends and family. And what do we need for this uh, beautiful lamb chops? So we need obviously the, la the lamb chops. Uh, they, I got this in my local supermarket here. They're beautiful. Oh, so savory, you'll see, you'll see. And then we need the garlic, fresh. Fresh means garlic, so I like to use fresh garlic. I, uh, any, any seasoning of your liking, I like that one. Uh, fresh ground pepper, just fresh ground black peppercorns. And then I like to use teriyaki sauce and rosemary. Teriyaki sauce and rosemary, and there you have it. This is all you need, so let's go step by step. So we go first with the fresh ground pepper, and we go all over the pork, the, la the lamb chops on both sides. We're gonna do the same thing on both sides. So we did the pepper first. Now we're gonna do the seasoning here, kind of light seasoning. So we're gonna go pepper seasoning. We're gonna put a little bit of rosemary here on top of, that, of it all. Just a little bit of rosemary there as well. And we're gonna we're gonna give it a few drops of the teriyaki. So I put my finger here to control the drops. And it's just gonna be a little, little, little few drops of teriyaki sauce marinade uh, on each side. Then we're gonna pat this down. We're gonna pat this down and we're gonna do the same thing on both sides. The garlic, we're gonna leave it for the, for the end. So we're gonna turn these around upside down. So you turn your chops upside down. We do the same thing on the other side. We're gonna go fresh ground pepper, the seasoning of your preference. I like this Badia uh, Complete Seasoning. Badia Complete Seasoning. And we go with a little bit of rosemary again on this side and a few drops of the teriyaki marinade. This is gonna, you know, the lamb chops have a strong flavor. This is gonna neutralize all that strong flavor. So we're gonna pat, pat it down. And now we're gonna go with the garlic and make sure every one of these lamb chops gets a little bit of garlic right on top of the meat, just like that. Pat it down, and we're gonna flip them upside down and do the same thing on the other side. Just put garlic all over it, and until you are done with your garlic. That was about a tablespoon of uh, garlic. And now we're gonna put this in a bag, you gotta let this soak all these uh, seasonings. So we're gonna put this in a seal bag here and we are going to make sure, there you go. We leave this here for a bit. So we're gonna leave this here up for about two hours. So after two hours or, or if you wanna do overnight, if you want, I have my indoor grill here and we're gonna, we're gonna cook this right straight there so i'm going to spray with the cooking i'm going to just put them just like that close the lid and this is going to be medium heat for about seven minutes so medium heat for about seven minutes and this is how they should look after seven to eight minutes over medium heat in this specific model of indoor grill and I, ser I serve this with these potatoes here, and you can you can look for the recipe of those potatoes in another video right after this one. And this is how they should look. I hope you enjoy. Remember to like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends and family. There you have it. Indoor grill lamb chops using my George Foreman grill.